think uh, the, it's um, the, heart, the heartbeat of your community. I think uh, that the use it gets with not only the kids that go there, although it be a low number, but also the adult users that are there, the ethnic minorities that are there that are using it, is a very important asset in our community and I think it's important that it's retained. I believe in the school, I believe in the community, I believe that the officials have been trying to close the school for far too long. If they had put as much effort into actually making the school better than they have in trying to close the school down, then we wouldn't be standing here right now. Uh, Terry Wrigley, uh, I edit an international journal called Improving Schools. I, I think the arguments that a school, a small school, is unviable are, are just nonsense in international terms. The average school size in Finland, the highest achieving country in the world, is 300 for secondary schools. Well, I think if um, strength of feeling, emotion and determination is any indicator, then surely the council have to listen to them. There's no doubt that they feel very, very passionately that their school plays an important part in the community, in their education, and they want Castlebury School to have a future. I had understood that the report was already out some weeks ago and that it does recommend closure. You don't seem to be taking no for an answer. That's the good thing about Nidra and the Greater Craig Muller community spirit. We've always been uh, great community activists and we're showing that again today with the numbers that's turned up. We will not accept it until the council, we'll keep getting told that the council decision has not been made until they've made that decision, Save the Bay will continue fighting.